was making another video. Uh, ripped this door back apart, and all that black is sound deadener. Uh, we're doing it on the inside. Listen to this. Listen to this. Solid. Solid, solid. So I'm getting in here. And I missed a little square right there, but I'm getting down in there and getting it all. Uh, doing the best I can. So I bought two rolls. I used maybe a quarter roll for one door so far. Don't be afraid to overlap. Ain't gonna fucking hurt it. And then there's a crash bar that goes along here. I'm gonna get off behind that and put a couple pieces in there. And then I'll probably just do, I don't know, maybe a couple pieces on the outside of the red here. Instead of doing the rear, so. I mean, there's some places I can put a couple pieces in. I'm afraid to get it lodged in there for the window to go up and down. Um, other than that, we got some shit straightened up in here. I got, uh, what I'm gonna do is possibly just put some fabric over that or something. I mean, it really doesn't matter. But um, that little taste test I got, holy fuck, I'm so ready. Got that much clearance in the back here. I mean, she can slide back a little bit yet. How much further can I bring her back? Uh, yeah, I can come back at least two, three inches. So. And then there's all kinds of these hooks. What I'm going to do is I'm going to hook a strap around the batteries. Everything else is mounted. Like, this shit ain't going nowhere. The amps are mounted. The caps are mounted. Can't, they won't go nowhere. The only thing that's not mounted is this amp. So, i going to mount that. That's the only thing back here that I got to do yet. Other than tweak it in. And then just finish these door speakers, these door pods. So, it's work, man. It's definitely a lot of fucking work. You don't want to rush it. There's the back looking in. Super, super happy. This is a gigantic box, though, man. I wonder... No wonder she hits those lows. But uh, this system is going to be so much fucking better than what I had. It's like double, double the shit. I fired her up. My wires are working good. Got straight to the alternator. Anything I don't have up front is I want to get a good ground in here. Uh... Any ideas on how I can get a ground? Right here's the factory one. There's nothing you can really get on to the battery. So I'm sort of fucked. Like, I don't really know where to put a good ground. I want to beef this one up, though. Beef up the ground up in the front here. So... I definitely want to beef the fucking ground up here up front. I just don't know where. Any ideas? Help me out. I mean, I don't see any ground on an alternator. I see no ground on there. I think it's grounded to the uh, post. That alternator looks like a bitch to put in. I want to get a high output alternator next. Looks like it just 
mounts there. He mounts there and there. Alright, man, I know I'm boring, you guys. But tell me how I can ground this when I can't get anything on the fucking battery. I got some good grounds in the back. I got two good grounds. I hit them with the meter and they said like 0.1. So they're good grounds. Other than that, I need to find one up front. Just one good one and I'm going to be set. I got a 200 amp fuse up front, a 200 amp fuse in the back. Uh, other than that, I'm going to go. Let me get started on the JLs up front. All right, guys, I'm going to go rest a little bit. I've been at it for hours. See if these guys want to go to the store and get some fucking dessert or something. All right, man, peace.